I do get asked quite a bit for my skincare routine. I don't remember the last time I have put one out into the world. I love Kiehl's. Y'all, the first time I ever tried this was the first day of the rest of my life. I like it because it feels like you're at a spa. This is another product that I swear like once I've used consistently. I've seen a big change in my skin. This is definitely favorite. And that, ladies and gents, is my skincare routine. Make up. One thing about Sierra is she gonna make a mess when she cooks. That's a small burrito. I'm making tacos instead. Breakfast tacos. She doesn't even go here. I wanna know if anyone fights with their man at the gym. Tired as fuck. Last night we went to go see Dune, and that movie's long as fuck. And I've been waking up at 6 a.m. to work out, so going to sleep like after 12 now, I'm like, Ugh. I'm tired. The goatee's tired. Um, I have this Erwan coffee from two days ago, but this Erwan coffee is so strong, the strongest coffee. That it's taking me two days to finish it. So I'm gonna finish it now, hopefully it'll wake me up. I'm gonna make some eggs. Um, I'm eating healthy right now, so I'm gonna show you guys just how healthy I eat. Maybe Sierra will eat something. I don't know, sometimes she'll be skipped. Sometimes she don't eat all day. Sometimes she'll have like Whatever. a, she'll have like a graham cracker and some like string cheese. Uh, and then we're gonna work out. Right, Sierra? And then um, Sierra's gonna do her skincare routine with me because my skin's good, but her skin's better. So for my morning eggs, I, um, I've been doing a diet plan. Usually I just have oatmeal and protein in the morning, but I'm sick of that because it's Saturday and I just wanna eat something different. So I'm gonna eat eggs today. We're not allowed to use any like oils or butters on this diet. So this is just gonna be a very healthy omelet. I do like four eggs. Um, I'm gonna do some onions, and I'm gonna find whatever the fuck else I have. Let's do it. I had this leftover little roll of onions. Let's see if I know how to cut onions right. I'm gonna do some peppers too. This omelet gonna have a shitload of vegetables. Throw these vegetables on there. She's copying me. Mm -hmm. I like mine a little spicy, so I use some of this. Top it off with some flaky sea salt. Throw it onto a paper plate because we hate dishes. Look at her just copying me. Down to the tea. Just Down no. to the T. I'm gonna, mine is gonna be so much better than yours. Why? What are you gonna do differently? I'm making it. I'm making a breakfast burrito. That's the motherfucking breakfast. That's the motherfucking breakfast. Copycat in the building. 
haters in the building. Du -du -du. One thing about Sierra is she gonna make a mess when she cooks. One thing about Sierra is she gonna make a mess when she cooks. That's a small burrito. I'm making Ooh. tacos instead. Breakfast tacos. We're going low and slow to make my scramble because I kind of like like a French scramble situation. Oh, cheese. Mm -hmm. Put in the tortilla with the bare hand. <laughs> mm. Get nice and tasty. Let's get another one going. This is a small avocado. Oh, wow, look at that plating. So precise. So calculated. My salud. My favorite flavor is the paloma. It's chef's kiss. I think Jonathan's a little bit jealous. Well, I didn't know we were able to make tacos. <laughs> and then this is my favorite. The habanero salsa. Taste test. That's pretty darn delicious. Another rainy day in LA. Go, enjoy it. Go, let's see what happens. Go! Yeah! Yeah, right! You done? Do you give up yet? Dude, you're gonna get soaked! Get back inside! Dude, it's boring! Get inside! <laughs> Lenny, come here! Come inside! Get inside! You're gonna get soaked! Sierra! You ready to go to the gym? She doesn't even go here! I guess I'm as ready as I'll ever be. Not quite, if I'm gonna answer honestly. I have a question for everyone. Do you and your partners ever just use each other's toothbrushes? Jonathan uses my, it. Look, I'm not doing it, it now. It grosses me out. I'm not doing it now, but if I'm on vacation and I forgot a toothbrush. And he always does. I'm gonna use her toothbrush. And I think that's okay. I don't, he didn't realize, he didn't know that cavities are contagious. They're not. They are. No, they're not. Yes, they are. Look it up. Ask your dentist. Okay. We're going in with the Cactus Fruit 3-in-1 Styling Cream from Day. I like using this to smooth out my hair whenever I'm doing slick back looks. And I kind of want to slick it back for the GM. I also love bed head. I've been using this little bed head after party since I was a child. I love it. The smell is so nostalgic to me. And then I, it's like my favorite thing to put in my hair at the end of my look with a little bit of oil to bring some shine and sheen back. Going in with a wet brush to smooth and slick. I'm not trying to make it super perfect, you know, it's just a gym look. We just want it out of our face, <clears throat> not in the way. Is that a ponytail? And then... I had three chips of hoys last night. I admit it, I had three chips of hoys last night. <laughs> I had to get it off my chest. Before you went to the gym? Or just in general? In general. I did it. Do you feel better? Going in with some Sebastian Shaper. Another thing I've been using since childhood. Fun fact about me, every woman in my family has their hair license. I grew up with a lot of hairdressers and I can like get the job done, but by no means can I call myself. Stick to acting. <laughs> That was very rude. I'm just going in with a light moisturizer because I don't want to clog my face at the gym. Not for the man before gym skincare routine. Ladies, if you're watching, leave. Men, if you're watching, watch. I obviously don't want to wash my face because I'm about to just sweat. But I do want to get the sleep grease off, so I do go on with the toner. When I get back in the gym, I'll shower and wash my face. 
I'm actually like not it's a daytime like wash face. Yeah, I do it at night. Otherwise, I feel like it's too stripping. Like, my skin gets really dry and irritated. Kira hates it when I steal her product. She gets sent so much stuff for free. I'm like, why can't I just have some? I'm also gonna go in. <laughs> I'm also gonna go in with the Summer Friday Rich Cushion Cream because it does great on my skin. Don't forget deodorant. I have this really cute set on from Aritzia. It's got little bell bottoms, but it's so cold out. So I don't think I want to do that. So I don't put on makeup um, to go to the gym, but what I do like to do is put like a little Benetton. Especially if I don't have concealer on, it just makes me feel a little bit more alive. A little Summer Fridays. This is their lip butter balm in birthday cake that came out for their birthday. And it's limited edition, but I need them to keep this because I'm obsessed with the flavor. It's so good. And I'm gonna go in with a little body mist because no one wants to stank a jam. This is the Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Crush Chirosa. Chirosa, 68. It's the one that kind of smells like pop rot. Off to the gym. Fun fact, my dad made me these. They're customized. They say Sierra, Alexa, Mirrors. And then they say Chi Chi mm. on the side, which is what he called me. It's kind of late, it's like two, but I don't mind going to the gym late on Saturdays when we have yeah. nothing to do. And Sierra's vowed to go to the gym with me every Saturday now. Um, I don't remember seeing that ever. You have vowed. I did not vow. To go to the gym with me every Saturday. I'll go with you today. I've gone with you like the last two weekends, right? This is just the second time. What are we doing today? What are we hitting? Arms. Ugh. You hate, you hate arms? I thought you liked arms. I hate arms. I want to know if anyone fights with their man at the gym. Can you get your cold hands out of my damn chest? <laughs> yeah, Sierra does not take criticism well. Not even criticism. She doesn't take... What, what, what would you call it? She doesn't correction? take... Correction? Correction. Or people speaking human words to her. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and Jonathan, another one thing that... Pe like a pet peeve of mine of his... Wait, I can't even speak. A pet peeve of mine at the gym with him is he doesn't like wearing headphones. He doesn't want me to wear my headphones. Well, because I'm trying to like talk to her. I don't want to talk and work out. Well, no, I'm trying to like teach you. You know, when I work out, I like to, you know, show a girl how to work out because I, I really feel like she should work out the proper way. And Dune 2 just came out and I'm playing a real bad guy in the movie. We're obsessed with Dune 2. No, I'm, I'm Austin Butler and I play, uh, Fade in the new um, Doom 2. Really special movie. You should go check it out. Was that good? Yeah, that's great. Um, yeah, I'm. Uh, yeah, I'm Timothy Chalamet. Um, I love Kid Cudi. Um, <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Doom 2 just came out. Yeah, it's good. Get up your phone. Get into the workout. Hi friends. Um, my workout was, I'd say a six and a half out of 10 and it wasn't because of my instructor. The hell? It's just because I personally was not feeling 100% today. My girlies know. She's on her period. It's, it's that time of the month. I just started today. Mm. So, you know what? Actually, I'll add it up to 7 out of 10 because I pushed myself. I'm here. I didn't make an excuse like I normally would, so I'm proud of myself for that. But could I have gone a little bit harder? Definitely. Anywho, we are about to go eat some food. 
fuel up after that pump. Watch this. Oh, wow. We were clearly very hungry. So I forgot to show you guys. This shit's hidden. Mmm. So good. I didn't have time to wait for y'all. Here's my chicken bar. And then I have some tade, which is my favorite crunchy rice. And Persian salad. And of course, you gotta wash it down with a good beer. Ain't that right? That is right. Hello, everybody. We are back from our day activities back home, freshly showered, and we thought it'd be a good, a good idea to share our skin guarantee. Sincere has such good skin. Oh, that's very sweet. I do get asked quite a bit for my skincare routine. I don't remember the last time I have put one out into the world. Um, so I thought I'd update you on some of my new favorite or old faves that are in my routine. Um, what I will start by saying is I did some stuff in the shower that wasn't seen. Um, I usually always start and I double cleanse with the Tatcha Camellia Cleansing Oil. Obsessed. Um, I will usually take like a makeup wipe, take off my makeup with that, and then I'll go in with this. And I feel like it just like really like melts down all of your makeup. And then... I cleanse with the Kiehl's Calendula Deep Cleansing Foaming Face Wash. I love Kiehl's. Kiehl's has been a favorite of mine for years. Um, so you can actually use this every single day, but since we're doing a more extravagant and thorough skincare routine for you right now, I'm gonna skip this one and do an actual exfoliator. Um, but this is a Tatcha Rice Polish Classic. I love using this in the shower too because it's super easy. It's like a little powder. You pour it into your hand, put a little bit of water, make a paste, and then it, it's not super abrasive. You can use it every day and your skin is like a squeaky little baby's butt. Come here, Jonathan. What's poppin'? Yeah, skincare routine. I'm gonna just keep it simple. I wash my face. I, I, I go to a girl that does my facials once a month and uh, she saved my life. She showed me which face wash to use. It's um, from? DMK. Yeah, DMK is the line. And first, I wash with this. I usually wash like at night and in the morning because I have really oily skin and I sweat a lot. So if I don't um, wash my face twice a day, I possibly could break out. I haven't been breaking out lately. My skin's been making me proud. Next up on my list, I'm going in with the Dr. Dennis Gross Universal Daily Peel. Y'all, the first time I ever tried this was the first day of the rest of my life. I am truly obsessed with the way that if I'm consistent, this makes my skin look and feel. I feel like it's definitely worth a try. They have different um, types of strengths. And I want to say that this one is like Super like for sensitive because I, I I do have very sensitive skin. This one I think you can actually use daily, um, but I don't because my skin will kind of go a little crazy on me. But I love the way it makes my skin look and feel, and especially under makeup. I feel like my face oh it's just it's so good. It's definitely worth a try. A little bit more on like the expensive side of skincare, but that's one thing that I always. Um, don't mind investing in because you're investing in yourself and the future. So first one is to exfoliate and smooth. Kind of just go all over your face and rub in a circular motion. And then I usually stop whenever the pad starts to feel dry. So we'll kind of go at this for a little bit. I didn't get mad at me when I use these, but can I use one for my skincare routine? You don't, yes. But I do not get mad. Yeah, you do. It's because he abuses my skincare. Does anyone else's man do that too? Like they just don't know how to properly use. Like a little goes a long way with a lot of things. And I don't think Jonathan really understands that. Going in with my second part. This is the anti-aging neutralizer. And this is where I really feel like the magic happens. You notice such a difference in your skin. I wonder if Jonathan's gonna feel it. Now we have this 
seru I like it because it feels like you're at a spa it's extra luxurious I'll stay here for a little bit how nice <laughs> next up I'm gonna go in with my Caudalie Vino Perfect Serum. This is probably my third bottle. I go through this so much. I'm already getting towards the bottom. Sad, sad day. <clears throat> but I love this stuff. And again, this is another. Let me get some. This is another product that I swear like once I've used consistently. I've seen a big change in my skin. Never forget your neck and your chest. When you're moisturizing and putting serums on is that it is one thing that people neglect and that's which like one of the first things that shows aging especially our generation with the way we're constantly texting and looking down you gotta really moisturize your neck it's nighttime i'm gonna go in with an estee louder advanced night repair synchronized multi-recovery complex like I'm getting a little irritated from the exfoliating. Let's go in with some anti-wrinkle. I actually just got sent this in the mail. I haven't tried it, but I thought now would be a perfect time. It's the Peter Thomas Roth Peptide Skin Injection Amplified Wrinkle Fix Serum. Helps eliminate and prevent the look of wrinkles with a 19% peptide complex of amplified matrixel and arguralene. <laughs> this is a lot. Just put on different serums. I don't usually do that. I stick to like one a night, but I'm just putting all of them on to show you my faves. This is definitely favorite. Peter Thomas Roth Peptides Conjection Moisture Infusion Cream. And then this will be our last step. I actually put this thing from the same brand that does my face wash. It's a hydrating oil. The person that does my facials recommended I put it on before I go to sleep. Cause it protects my face from like bad oils and sweat and stuff in the night. So I took her word for it. <laughs> so far so good. Last but certainly not least, going in with the Caudalie Beauty Elixir. This just feels like a treat. Again, my skin is a little irritated from what? the exfoliator, but. What's this now? Just the last step. Mmm, very nice. Very nice. And that, ladies and gents, is my skincare routine. It's Saturday night. Our skin's looking right. We're healthy right now because there ain't shit to do this weekend, so we're gonna stay in and watch a movie. Like and subscribe. We're almost at 20,000 followers. <gasps> followers, subscribers. For real? We're at 60. We got four more to go. I was thinking we should do, um, once we hit 20,000 subscribers, we should do like a giveaway. Oh, that would be nice. We'll give something away. We'll think about what the giveaway is. Maybe Lennon. Maybe we'll give our dog away. <laughs> but I'm just kidding. We always have to bring her in on the- It'll be big. It'll be big. It'll be huge. 20,000 subscribers. Subscribe. Don't be mean. Don't be rude. Bye. Love you.